Hello everybody, welcome back. So uh, today in this video we have a heater and actually it's a new heater, a new generation heater, Electronic 3. And uh, the heater is back uh, because the customer is saying that the heater is stopping suddenly, so it's not working. And uh, as you can see, it's, it's used, it's not that clean <laughs> anymore, like we have in cases that this is a warranty, so it's not really taken care of, but uh, from this it should still work. So we can see Electronic 3 manufactured in the 38th week of 2021. So um, still in warranty, relatively new heater. Oh, I have my flash on. Let me just stop it. And uh, the diagnostics will confirm this. We will go to operating data, read it. And what is happening here is we see that we have 763 glow plug activations and we have about 230 flame aborts in uh, the low levels and also sometimes four in high and so so this will uh, lead us that this is a problem with the fuel yes because it's stopping so many times and actually can we see yes yeah, so we have 380 starts of which 230 is failed so yes and uh, this leads us that this is a problem with uh, fuel but the thing is that the customer which is a workshop which has a lot of experience in heaters I would say changed to a different heater the second generation and uh, since then we had no complaints so what we need to do now is start testing the the heater and actually in fault memory the only thing we have is one of course we have fault mirror memories we have here a lot of things um, including sensors overheatings too many overheatings burner motor blocking and so on so uh, we have to see what the problem is and only one with burner motor blocked and this is the last one that the heater had before it was taken down uh, so what we need to do we will start the heater and uh, leave it on diagrams to see what the heater is doing temperatures and so on and if we can recreate the fault hopefully we can because if not then i don't know so i will start the heater we'll see you a little bit later with the results if any okay so we left the heater running for about half an hour, an hour, it worked just fine. Then I stopped it and uh, I tried to start it again. It started, but after a while it stopped with these errors. Yeah, and actually third or fourth time I started, it also gave out a glow plug interruption, which is insane because <laughs> just a uh, few starts ahead, the unit was working. It, it cannot be that the glow plug interrupted but uh, I guess it's something have to do with this one because uh, as you can see uh, no sorry th these were the faults that I deleted but this 306 in the manual it says replace the control box yeah so I, I guess that's what we have to do because if we go ahead and clear the faults yes we will also clear this one which technically should not be possible but <laughs> it is so we will go back to report yes and uh, read 
the data from the heater which is now ok so we have no faults and uh, we will do a self test of the heater let's see the fan should start ok you can see the fan is moving the pump should also work let me just touch the pump you can't hear that no it already stopped so it no means it's not ok why we will go back to the fault memory refresh and again these two ones are back so even if we can suspect the glow plug there's no reason to look at it because we see there's a problem with the electronics so that's it guys, the first ECU for an L23, we will change it and send it back to the customer, the heater, and that's it, okay, bye bye.